Oahu's population is now over one million, living on an island of less than 600 square miles. We import almost all of our food, with ruinous environmental effects and the potential for real disaster in the event of any disruption in the food supply. And prices for fresh food are higher than most families can afford. Sadly, conventional farming is being priced out of existence and can't satisfy local demand. But there's a new, healthier, more productive and better way to farm that can eventually solve these problems. We can reduce the need for imported food and drive down the price of fresh food so that local families can afford to eat more healthily. This is the story of Nalolicious Farms. Well, it's located in Waimanalo, hence Nalo, and our produce is delicious, so it's Nalolicious. Well, we chose Waimanalo because it's a really special place. It's one of the last places on Oahu that actually has some agricultural lands available. And it's about the perfect climate to uh, farm year-round. The problem is that the land's taken a real beating. In the past decade or two, the place has been completely fallow. When we took over, it was covered with trash and brush and all kinds of stuff. And it's taken us many, many hours of hard work and lots of volunteer labor and a lot of borrowed equipment just to clear this place so we can get started and actually begin farming. Aquaponics is a very efficient way to farm. We start with fish, and the, the fish waste is pumped into our grow beds where naturally occurring bacteria break the waste down and transform it into nitrates, which fertilizes the plants. And the plants in turn purify the water, and that purified water is sent back into the fish tank. We start our plants in vermicast, and we can go from a little seedling to a full head of lettuce in about three weeks. Aquaponics uses about 2% of the water of conventional farming, and it's about six times more efficient. The local market is really demanding local organic produce. We've got hundreds of restaurants, dozens of shops, all clamoring for fresh local organic produce. But it's not just about the produce. World fish stocks are collapsing, and conventional fish farming techniques have significant health issues. Aquaponic water is clean and clear, producing healthy, delicious fish in a sustainable manner. Hawaii are, are fish lovers. They, they, like, they love the, the fish, you know, so the tilapia and catfish. Um, if we can grow it, we can sell it. We built our first eight grow beds using pretty much recycled materials, cinder blocks and timbers from here on the, on the property, three truckloads of plastic pallets we found in town. And with a lot of sweat and hard labor and a lot of help from our friends, we've been able to get the first part of this thing started. But quite frankly, it's become so much work that we both had to quit our jobs and just, just farm full time just to get this done. And we're having a lot of success. We've bred thousands of tilapia and Chinese catfish, and they'll soon be ready to nourish our crops. But we've run out of the free materials that are available to us, and this is where we need help. We need to build five more fish tanks and eight more grow beds just to get to the point where we're self-sustaining. And you know, this is bigger than just one little farm. Hawaii has a critical need for locally grown, nutritious food. And we can help provide that. And by doing so, we can show the way to a new and different way of farming that's cleaner, safer, and healthier for workers, for the consumer, and for the aina. All we need is a little help. Aloha nui loa from Waimanalo.